This video shows you how to connect your Epson printer to a wireless network. In this demonstration, you will be using the printer's buttons to select wireless settings. Before you start, there are a few things you need to check. Do I already have a wireless network? First, make sure you have a network already set up. Your network may include one or more computers or an internet modem connected to a router. Before making a connection, make sure that your router is wireless. Later, you will see how to add your Epson printer by connecting it to the router. You'll also need to know your wireless network's name. This is called the SSID. The SSID was entered into your router when it was first set up. What security settings am I using? If you have wireless security turned on, you'll also need to know your network password. If you don't have this information, ask the person who set up your network. Now, let's set up your Epson printer and add it to your network. When you're done, you'll be able to print wirelessly from this computer. You can add the ability to print from another computer later on. Follow the steps on the Start Here sheet. The Start Here sheet shows you how to physically set up your printer. When you get here, install your printer software. Insert the CD that came with your printer. If you do not have a CD-ROM drive, you can download the software from the Epson support site. Click Install. Follow the instructions on the screen to install the software. This can take several minutes. Your product may detect your wireless settings and automatically connect to your network. If it doesn't, you will need to manually add your printer to your network. At this screen, select how you want to connect. Since you want to print wirelessly, select Wireless Connection and click Next. Now select the option to set up the printer for the first time and click Next. Since you'll be using the printer buttons to connect to your wireless network, choose Using Printer Buttons and click Next. When you get to this step, look at your printer's control panel. If you do not see this screen, press the Home button. Then press the left arrow button until you see Wi-Fi Setup. Press OK. Then press OK again to select Wi-Fi Setup Wizard. Now you'll choose your wireless network and enter its password. Press the down arrow button until you see the name of your network. Then press OK to select it. Next, enter your wireless password. Use the arrow buttons to highlight a character. Then press OK to select it. Highlight the backspace button and press OK to delete incorrect characters. To enter lowercase letters, select the lowercase AB12 and press OK. To switch back to uppercase, select the uppercase AB12 and press OK. To enter special characters or symbols, select Symbol and press OK. If your password contains uppercase or lowercase letters, be sure to enter them in the correct case. When you're done entering your password, select Done and press OK. Press OK again to confirm. Select Yes and press OK to print a network status report, or select No and press OK to complete wireless setup. Follow the rest of the instructions on the computer screen to finish installing the software. Your Epson product is now ready to print wirelessly. If you want to print from another computer, insert the CD that came with your printer, or run the software you downloaded and follow the instructions on the computer screen. When you get to this step, select The printer is already on my wireless network. Follow the rest of the instructions on the computer screen 
to install the software on your computer. You can repeat this process for any additional computers. You are now ready to print wirelessly from your computers.